Nice. Yeah, so yeah, it has been an interesting week. So on Wednesday we rolled out uh, the first patch. Uh, yesterday we started the season, and at the same time we are working on the on the new patch. Uh, so we are closing closing the the next patch uh, this week and next week, and then that patch will be uh, after our internal testing. It will be sent out to first parties for approval. All stakeholders need to have their approvals, and uh, yeah, after that uh, it's ready to be rolled out. So essentially, um, it takes a little while. Yeah, from when from when we finish a patch to when it actually goes in game uh, can can be a little bit of time. Yeah, and it's mainly because the the cross cross platform functionality what we have with Truck Central, with leaderboards, with Ghosts, uh, with Gear Central. So we have to uh, make sure that all all clients, all platforms are in sync. Uh, we have to roll the patches simultaneously. So we also need to get the approvals. Approvals for all patches, like at the same time, right? And I guess, like, you know, you mentioned there's a lot of stakeholders, a lot of people <laughs> oh, yes. involved in that process. Oh yes, and oh, I yes. bet uh, in general, like, they all have different processes as well. Yeah, they're, yeah, yeah, for you know, sure. Often cases, different, different companies, yeah, different checklists, <laughs> uh, different, yeah, different everything. Right. Yeah. So it's it's really interesting, and that's like yeah, closing a patch is it's really interesting process <laughs> like to be a diplomat <laughs> all right so now um i think what the what the people are really interested in is maybe a little information about what kind of stuff we're going to have in the next patch yeah right so yeah we are working uh we are working on the issues that you guys are reporting uh and like john said like not everything will be fixed in uh, or was fixed in the in this patch that rolled out or even in the next one so but we are we are uh working on the fixes for every we would love rolling out patches regularly but i think yeah i think the biggest uh, thing that has caused uh, issues for you guys have been the inventory like things with inventory it's definitely one we hear a lot about yeah <laughs> so basically i think uh, the reason there like for most of the issues is the, the sync between the client and the servers and uh yeah we've done several several fixes for those and yeah, I think the uh, the duplicate items uh, that's definitely something uh, that uh, has caused issues. Uh, we are addressing that uh, the infinite loading on some items. Uh, uh, some people have had troubles with the ULC, ULC. So we are addressing uh, that as well. And. Uh, and that's for people that don't know the lingo ULC. That's stuff like pre-order <laughs> bonuses, right? And uh, the like the UPlay rewards, stuff like that. Yeah, it's working on games. It's just working with acronyms. <laughs> like we have so many different. Yeah, every, like, everything has its own little <laughs> like acronym. Yeah, it's great when it's like somebody a new team member joins a team and we have our morning meeting and it's just like people talk with these <laughs> th three-letter uh, acronyms and <laughs> that's so much fun. <laughs> Yeah, um, and I think also yeah. we've uh, we've addressed the issue where people stop getting gear crates for leveling up. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, yeah, yeah. That as well. Yeah. So yeah, that is there is also right. a fix for that. Badger has made a request. He wants us to go <laughs> to Finland. Nice. Maybe what we shouldn't do a no lean contract. We're gonna skip this for now. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right. So so a bunch of fixes for inventory stuff. That's great. Um, another thing that we hear a lot about is the progression, hmm. um, and I know we've done a few things to address this. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Yeah, yeah. So we've taken a few steps uh, to uh, improve and balance. Um, I think the biggest thing uh, is, uh, especially for for more advanced players, is uh, uh, so we have a, like a well, shortcut <laughs> 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 uh, in tutorials. So uh, if you are able to pass a tutorial track with A or A+, plus, uh, you unlock the stadium final for that league directly, uh, which uh, helps you, uh, you know, uh, gaining some, like, jumping over a few uh, fame levels. Excellent. So essentially, yeah. uh, you'll be able to unlock tracks a lot faster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Come on, guys, you need to do the time saver here. Uh, <laughs> okay. Like that? No, no, no. Just, the, the, like, like that we need to do the bus through, so, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. go, go, go. Oh, <laughs> nice timing. <laughs> Just a little. Now, yeah, yeah. Yes. Nice. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, and also like some other uh, like yeah, uh, uh, other minor uh, improvements, uh, the balancing. We added uh, more soft currency to gear crates uh, so that you can unlock the the fun bikes, donkey bike, and the helium bike faster, uh, and unlock the Anva contract faster, which like then again gives you more fame. All right, um, mm -hmm. and then my last official question. Um, I know a lot of our viewers are track builders, and they're very concerned that uh, that some people have lost uh, saves in mm, the track yeah, editor. Yeah. Uh, what can you say about that? Yeah, well, first of all, <laughs> that will be fixed in the next patch, so uh, so that's good news. And of course, uh, for Track Central, uh, yeah, we are we're working on improving it, improving it, uh, uh, and uh, yeah. But the the the, the most the, the difficult thing with the truck saving that, that it, it will be addressed. Definitely, yeah, yeah. Um, and we are also we are also looking at track central stuff. Um, I know I saw the list uh, of what we're what we're going to be looking at. Uh, nothing we can really confirm there yet, uh, but we will be doing some improvements to track central as well.